hello youtube what's up so in this tutorial we will discuss how we can install django on anaconda so anaconda is nothing but a good software so where we can combine all the lib uh, python libraries including python and uh, it's a combined package of that and uh, so uh, we saw that uh, so many developers facing issue uh, to install this uh, Django over Anaconda so we will install today's video uh, Django on Anaconda so let's get started so first we will download so this is my windows machine so I will use this one So I found one uh, one interesting article. So I will follow those. Um, Django install Anaconda. This one. So Anaconda is installed right now. So let's click on this one. The installation part will take uh, like so much time, around 10 to 15 minutes. So I will pause this video once the process will start. So this window is open. Let me click next. Next just me okay on C yes so this is the critical part over there so in this article they are saying not while installing add anaconda on my path so make sure you click on this check button So I will put this not recommended but I will use this one. Let's see if we take time I will pause the video and after that I need one IDE so I will use PyCharm for this one. Uh, I think I have PyCharm in my PC. If not, I will install. I don't have. Let's install PyCharm. PyCharm is a very good software if you are using. It's very good IDE, not software. Okay, so let's install this one as well. If you have another uh, IDE like uh, uh, Sublime Text or another one, you can use that one as well after that we need to run those commands mm. okay so this process is going on I will install meantime on PyCharm The JetBrain is a very good ID. They provide very good ID. 
for java they provide inter ig this is one of the great id for java this one is asking for the permission let me enable okay so i don't need right now this one so let's install so i don't need this one this one as well I told you this one take around 40 uh, 10 to 15 minutes so I will do one thing I will pause this part and skip this one this one is successfully open now and my anaconda is also installed you can see that so this is processing will going on okay let them complete all we need to do we need to go to the terminal and apply all the commands that we set up Okay, so let me open the terminal first. You can see. This will take like a little bit of time because I just installed this one. They are just doing their stuffs so let me run this one first one So before doing anything just complete this one and then start so this will take a little bit time recently install everything so now it's started 
Muito louco. Isso nós outro é nera, maybe offshore. Now he's asking process why. Okay, now this is one is running. It's extracting, downloading, extracting the packages. If you are seeing this one please do not skip maybe use some miss important instructions so I want you to just watch and also you can continue do on your system as well so after this one we need to run another command is only one command install and after this we will check version then we will create a project uh, my site you can do your own project after that we will run the server and this one is a local host Now this one, I think this one is installed. Uh, let me check the version. It's showing no model name. Go. I think they use different model name. Don't worry about it. Let me create one project. Now you all can see uh, the uh, Django installed. Let me show you the version. It's using uh, 2.25, and uh, this one is my site. I just created a project using this command. You can check uh, Django admin start project my site, and you can see that I'm on my site and you can see that the Django project is created and if you are a developer you can know what, what, what to do next so this is how we can install Django on Anaconda so this process is still going on after that I can run all, all the commands I can start the server but if you are using this one or another so you can uh, start with these commands uh, run the server and check on the local host is running or not it will show you a good image of Django with the admin site as well so hope you like the video uh, if you have any question uh, please comment me on uh, comment me and I will add this link under the description and I'm sure that you will not face any issue under this one so my side this one is working perfectly so all the, all i need this uh, the process is still running on my side i have installed uh, django you can see that one the version is this one and if you are use uh, if you are running this one so you will have different version maybe okay then this one install just follow this one 
this one will install the django after that you can create project as well as run server and this one for local host hope you like the video uh, if you need more instruction you can uh, walk through this one this is the official document of the django and you can comment me also i will help on that definitely help on that thank you